How do plants protect themselves with a peel? Plants, just like us, have a skin or a peel, technically called the plant cuticle, and that helps to protect them from moisture loss, oxidation, and infection. What are those peels made of? Fatty acids, glycerides. Different fruits have different shelf lives because of the thickness and arrangement of these materials in those peels. So the idea then is, can we take these harmless, edible, plant-based ingredients, apply them in a thin layer on the surface of fresh fruits and vegetables to help reinforce the existing natural peel? And if you do that, can you help to retain peak flavor, texture, and nutrients for longer without reliance on refrigeration, pesticides, waxes, or plastics. So we took a test batch of material that we made using leftover tomato peels, since those are rich in these fatty acids and glycerides. We dipped those limes in a, like a bowl of these ingredients in water and set them aside to dry, and then we waited. And we saw that we could add an extra week of freshness to these limes. We then went and wanted to apply this little bit of extra peel to all other kinds of fruits and vegetables. Bananas, avocados, limes, green beans, tomatoes, bell peppers, cucumbers, berries, like, you name it. And what we saw amazed and, quite frankly, still amazes us. It really takes so little material. The little bit of extra peel we add to an average avocado, for example, that's equivalent in weight to a tenth of a small raisin. What I'm most proud of, though, it's why we got into all of this in the first place, and that is that since 2021, when we started measuring, we've prevented 166 million pieces of produce from going to waste, 